Unreal Engine 5 launched in April 2022. While there are many games already released utilizing the full potential of the engine, a lot of upcoming MMORPGs have had their planned release pushed and delayed due to developers deciding to switch to a new engine. And trust me, the wait is going to be 100% worth it if you are looking to immerse yourself into an almost realistic graphics in a breathtakingly open world. And that's why today I am bringing you 3 of many upcoming MMORPGs built on Unreal Engine 5 that plan to release in 2024. Chrono Odyssey is an upcoming MMORPG developed by the Korean studio Npixel that promises to incorporate intricate time travel mechanics into its gameplay and world. Originally planned for a 2022 release, the game shifted to the Unreal Engine 5 for a graphical upgrade which caused delays. Players will explore the world of Setera, a land threatened by disruptions to the fabric of time and space caused by the ominous force called the Void, wielding an artifact called the Chronotector that can manipulate time, players will work to unravel the mysteries of the Void and its goals. The open world design supports seamless travel between zones without loading screens. Combat in Chrono Odyssey will be action oriented allowing players to dynamically switch between two equipped weapons on the fly to adapt to different situations, while both PvE and PvP modes are planned. Large-scale boss battles against unpredictable foes will challenge groups of players to strategize together. Players can choose from six unique classes at launch, each specialized in two weapon types. Factions play a role as well, like the Guardians who oversee the world and the dangerous Void faction seeking to expand its influence through corruption. And Pixel received significant investment to support the development of the game. While the original target platforms included mobile, it is now PC and console focused only. Chrono Odyssey shows potential with its time manipulation premise and dynamic combat in a seamlessly open world. While release date is not officially known, it is safe to assume that throughout 2024, the game will be playable in its alpha and beta testing phases. Arcage was a hugely popular MMORPG released in 2013 that attracted millions of players with its sandbox gameplay and open world. Nearly a decade later, developers Excel Games have announced a sequel in the works titled Arcage 2. While the game is still in development with a planned release sometime in 2024, everyone is eager to learn more about what they can expect. Based on the information from Excel Games and promotional materials, it's clear that Arcage 2 will build upon the original in many ways while introducing new features as well. The game will utilize Unreal Engine 5 to push visuals and graphics far beyond the first title. This next generation engine should allow for vastly improved environments, character models and special effects. While continuing Arcage's beloved open world design, players will explore a completely new timeline and setting within the same realm. Some key systems from the original like trade rounds and player housing look to make a return. However, Excel games have emphasized these mechanics will see major updates and improvements. Arcage was always about player-driven systems, so it's likely Arcage 2 will push this further. Combat also appears slated for an overhaul. Promotional videos show more dynamic action-oriented fights between players and monsters. Character classes from Arcage may still be options, but new playable races are possible as well. The game's reveal trailer hints at the knights, mages, rangers and other archetypes making a comeback with evolutions to their moves and styles. With the same themes at the help and the next-gen budget, Arcage 2 has all the makings of one of the most ambitious MMORPGs yet. Only time will tell how it comes together before launch in 2024. But for now, there's a lot to be excited about regarding the future of this game. The developers at the Mainframe Industries are creating an immersive new sandbox MMO called PAX Day that aims to offer players a vibrant medieval world with innovative design choices. Using Unreal Engine 5, PAX Day transports players to a fantasy realm where myths are real and magic is unquestioned. In PAX Day, players will establish villages and homesteads in a relatively safe heartlands region. From these bases, player can craft tools, weapons and other goods to contribute to the fully player-driven economy. Resources and items are created only through player efforts like gathering, mining, hunting and crafting. With no NPC vendors or quest givers, 
players must rely on each other for goods and services. The building system allows for impressive and creating structures without being limited to preset buildings. Players can customize their homes, villages and forts with a vast array of placeholder pieces. Mainframe Industries is taking a community-focused approach to development. Through playable alpha tests and frequent discussions with players, the developers are crafting the game based on early feedback. The team aims to create a continually evolving world that changes according to player activity and decisions. Over time, new lands, new stories and systems will emerge from players' interaction rather than being imposed by developers. While specific release timing and pricing are still unconfirmed, PAX Day shows great promise for delivering an innovative sandbox MMO experience built around full player engagement, cooperation and emergence when it launches for PC using Unreal Engine 5. If Mainframe can realize their vision, PAX Day may become one of the most engrossing new worlds in gaming. Which of these 3 MMORPGs are you excited the most about? Let me know in the comments. Consider subscribing and watch some of my other content appearing on your screen.